Oh my god, I'm so bad at this. Okay. I want to say you're watching Disney Channel so bad, so bad. Okay. Hey guys, Vicuña here, and for today's video, we are watching the 1987 film Predator starring Arnold Schwarzenegger. So I'm super excited to watch this. I say that about every single movie, but I just got my herded. Mm. Mm, so I feel fresh, I feel amazing, and I'm wearing my flowy shirt. You guys know I love my flowy shirts. <laughs> so I'm feeling myself right now. It feels so good. And I love Arnold Schwarzenegger. I think that he is a great actor. I know some uh, Predator lore. Um, I think I have seen this film in the far distant past. Um, but I remember nothing of it. I just know there is a dense forest and he has a gun. There there are guns in this movie, so that's what I remember. <laughs> that's what I got here. <laughs> anyway, if you're new to the channel, thank you so much for being here. And if you happen to like the content, you should totally hit subscribe in order to catch all of my latest videos. That would be so awesome. It would help the channel so much and I would really appreciate it. And if you, you know, oh my god, my cat, oh my god, we go. <laughs> and if you happen to want to watch along with more films and see a little bit more Miko, because he comes in a lot, um, be sure to check out my Patreon. It's the link to it will be down below in the description. So I thank you so much for everything. <laughs> Let's get right into the video. I'm feeling goofy. This is bad. This is a mess. Oh no. <laughs> Let's see how this turns out. Okay, I changed again. Are you guys ready? <laughs> Alright guys, ready? Three, two, one, go. So I know the concept of Predator. Arnold is like, has green on his face, like dirt and stuff. And he has a machine gun and he's like walking through a forest shooting stuff. I know what Predator's face looks like. I, I think it's impossible to have lived this long without seeing Predator's face and his wonderful dreadlocks. Whoa. <laughs> Whoa! Oh my gosh! <laughs> the effects! <laughs> 87 and it shows. Carl Weathers is in this? Okay. Seems very serious. Kind of excited to watch this. See where it goes. Arnold! There he is! Oh my gosh, he looks so good in red. Look at him! What an entrance! It's been a long time, General. Come on inside. 18 hours ago, we lost a chopper carrying a cabinet minister and his aide. We've got a transponder fix on their position here. So why don't you use the regular army? Because some damn fool accused you of being the best. There's Carl. What's up, Carl? Dylan! You son of a bitch. <laughs> oh, that's a meme! I didn't know that was Arnold and Carl. The CIA got you pushing too many pencils. This is how real men shake hands. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. <laughs> but you didn't know in the quid, huh? I heard about that little job you pulled up in Berlin. How come you passed on Olivia, huh? We a rescue team, not assassins. What do we gotta do? We pick up their trailer, the chopper, run them down, grab those hostages, and bounce back across the border before anybody knows we were there. So, so far, what we see from Arnold's character is that he has values, you know? He has, like, a code he works by. He doesn't kill if he doesn't need to, obviously. Their rescue team, not assassins. So I like that. Ooh, he's good. Who's our backup? No such thing, old buddy. Oh, I don't like that. So where are they exactly? Like, what was the country? I feel like I missed that part. I didn't read it on the map. It's like gym class all over again. Make you climb that stupid rope. Pilots have each got one round in the head. This was no ordinary army taxi. Pick up the trail yet? Billy's on it. Something else. Six men wearing U.S. issued army boots. Get ahead and see what he can find. Yes. 
I was gonna ask if he was gonna just start eating it, and I didn't think he actually was. Oh my god! Oh! I don't like that. I don't like that one bit. Not a fan. Oh. Uh, no. No. I hate gore. I hate gore so much. Jim Harper. Or I know these or men. something. Green berets out of Fort Bragg. Now what the hell were they doing here? I don't know, Dutch. This is inhuman. Nobody told me there was an operation in this area. The gorilla skinned them? That's what I'm trying to figure out. That's disgusting. There was a firefight. They were shooting in all directions. It just doesn't make sense. What about the rest of Hopper's men? There's no signs. Hell, it's like they just disappeared. Maybe they're also in the trees? We move. Five meters spread. No sound. Payback time. They're being watched by the gorillas or... Predator! I'm assuming a predator's equipment can uh, pick up heat signatures. I don't think his eyes are just like that. I wonder why a predator would be on Earth. What would the reasoning be? Oh no! Oh. I don't care who you are back in the world. You give up position one more time, I'll bleed you real quiet. Leave you here. For a second, the way the black marks blended in with his hair, I thought those were just very, those were sideburns that just went onto his cheeks. Like a altered mutton chop. I don't know what they were doing in the 80s. I wasn't there. Maybe an alternate mutton chop is like, was in, you know? We slide. I killed one of the hostages. We move. <gasps> Trap. <sighs> Smart. How do they, there's so much leaves and brush? How do they not hear that? One down. I don't know what it is about that car engine idling sound, but it is so satisfying to hear right now. Mmm, car engine idle ASMR. I hate how satisfying it sounds! A nice distraction. And it's gonna blow up, yup! But it puts the hostages in so much danger! Like, you don't actually have a visual on where the hostages are. You could be shooting that from anywhere. <laughs> oh, my goodness. I was very right about the face paint and the gun. <laughs> it's so right. They're not even shooting anyone anymore. They're just blowing everyone up. Stick around. Oh, I hated that. I hated that. <laughs> Get a hostage. From the looks of it, our cabinet minister was CIA. Good work, Mac. You're bleeding, man. I ain't got time to bleed. It's not gonna stop it. Okay. <laughs> Say something gonna bleed. You got time to duck? Goddamn jackpot. This is what you're looking for. You sell sell! It's all bullshit. The cabinet minister, the whole business. Got us in here to do your dirty work. Why us? because nobody else could have pulled it off. You used to be somebody I could trust. You're a master, and I used you to get the job done. Got it? Dang, ruthless. Wait, she goes with us. She's too valuable. She's got to know their whole network. She'll give away our position any chance she gets. No deal. You're still under orders, Major. Now, you want to make that call, or should I? She's your baggage. You fall behind, and you're on your own. 
Give me a way out of this hole. The only way out of here is that valley that leads to the east. Not much choice. <gasps> a scorpion? Why can't you just flick it off of him? They really just use a scorpion just to kill it? I said to her, Jace, you got a big pussy. Jace, you got a big pussy. She said, why did you say that twice? I said I didn't because of the echo. What's with him and big vagina jokes? Well, I... <laughs> Ew, that sounds demonic. That, that sounds demonic in nature. He should be the first to go off of his demonic laugh. What is with him? He just thinks them over or I- Oh, he needs a new sense of humor because that's not working. I'd be scared of scorpions. I'd be paranoid about scorpions and tarantulas and such just falling on my back now after that stunt. Like a snake? Snakes are sneaky in the jungle. Snakes are sneaky in the jungle. Waterfall? It just seems like an open clearing, so I assumed there would be a waterfall or water nearby. Come on, sweetheart. Stop sandbagging it. Now get up. When my parents tell me it's time to go to school. I mean, I won't throw leaves in their face, but. Maybe you better put her on a leash, Agent Man. Try it again. Please. I'm assuming this guy's gonna be the first to get hunted. I just have a gut feeling. And hopefully he's next. All he so keeps talking about is, is large vaginas and it's making, it's just weird. <laughs> it's clear obsession with <laughs> these jokes. Come up with another topic, bro. Maybe small peepee -pee jokes too. <laughs> just go for the opposite. Don't pick up the log. She's so dumb. Like, I know she's just trying to protect herself. She'll try anything, but he's sitting right next to her. Like, please. His biceps honestly freaking me out right there. Oh, I don't like that. Too much muscles makes me uncomfortable. I, I don't really like muscly dudes. That's my, you know, preference. You teach their own. There's something in those trees. <laughs> The fact that he can just command his team, like, hand signs, just, just go do it. It's really good that they respect him, though. And they'll listen to him, trust his leadership. Oh no, he's, he's trying, he's gonna try and tell her a, a big pussy joke. Can camouflage like that. That's why they can't see him. Because he has practically perfect camouflage. Oh! Is that, is that his skin? Is that his skin? God's name. He told one too many bad jokes. That's what's happening. She says the jungle came alive and took him. Bullshit! Why didn't they take his radio or his weapon? Why didn't she escape? They did the same thing to Jim Hopper. It wasn't them, it was Predator that killed them. We gotta get out of the jungle ASAP. You just gotta get out of there. Oh, I'm not ready to see another skinned person. Uh, I've, had I've had enough of that for one day. Oh my gosh. You named the gun? Oh, it's just a little porcupine. Don't shoot. <gasps> He's leveling the whole forest. Oh, that's a classic shot. Arnold's like, I'm not even moving, bro. Not even phased. I think you would have gotten him. I think they got him by now. The wounds all fused, cauterized. What the hell could have done this to a man? Not a thing. We hit nothing. I set up flares, rags, and claymores. 
Nothing's coming near this place without tripping on something. Oh, it bleeds neon green blood. Oh, oh my gosh. He took off his camouflage. Oh. Roger, Blazer One. They say we're still in too far and they can't risk coming in after. I only saw one of them camouflaged. They disappeared. I'm scared, Pancho. You ain't afraid of no man. It's not a man. There's something out there waiting for us, and it ain't no man. Ooh, chills. He acts so tough, though. Whatever it is out there, killed Hopper, and now it wants us. I'm gonna cut your name and... They had a real bromance. Probably her, like, going to pee or something. Never mind. Oh my gosh. Jesus, you killed a pig. Do you think you could have found something bigger? <laughs> oh my gosh. I thought it was Predator. I was gonna say, that would be way too easy. And it didn't have glowing blood. So I thought it was him getting stabbed. Lane's body, it's gone. He wants the bodies. He wants to, he wants to amp up his KD. Oh. <gasps> They're trophies! The bodies are trophies, and he's doing it for sport. Those ain't no other tracks. How could anyone get through this? Like a hunter. Yeah. He's using the trees. Yesterday, what did you see? I don't know what it was. She speaks English. It changed colors. You saying that Blaine and Hawkins were killed by a fucking lizard? Like a comedian. It's like. Similar to. We make a stand now, or there will be nobody left to go to the chopper. There is something else. You must have wanted it. Its blood was on the leaves. If it bleeds, we can kill it. So they're gonna set up traps to try and kill it instead of running away from it. Because if they run, they're just gonna be hunted one by one. You really think this Boy Scout bullshit's gonna work? You can see our tripwires. Maybe you can see this. Instead of complaining, maybe you should help. Ooh, I didn't know Carl Weathers would be like the bad guy in this movie, other than Predator. The human bad guy. <laughs> I thought they were gonna be friends. He's shaving with his sweat. He's gonna have so much razor burn. So much gunk in his pores. When I was little, we found a man. The old woman in the village crossed themselves and whispered crazy things, like strange things. El que hace trofeos de los hombres means the demon who makes trophies of man. Having the tripwires. Oh! What? He has such a... Oh, he looks sick. I'm coming! Mac! Hold it, Dutch. I'm going after Mac. That's not your style, Dylan. Guess I picked up some bad habits from you. Now get your people the hell out of here. Oh. I can make it. I mean, he got destroyed by a giant log. I can't imagine. Oh. I'm gonna have me some fun. 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 He's afraid. He's propelled by emotion, though. He's doing his yoga exercises, his yoga stretches. He's got some tight hammies right now. You work your way down there toward him. I move up around, get in back of him, flush him toward him. I got a score to settle. He looks like he's standing like a gorilla. because you weren't armed. No sport. So, it wasn't a sport because she was unarmed. I get it. No fun, not as fun, not a challenge. But he also has like such a benefit with camouflage that it's not even fun. He's playing with a handicap. He's cheating. He's actually using hacks right now. 
Homie paid for the DLC and these are all noobs. It's not fair. It's not equal. <gasps> no way. Billy, let's go. I gotta go for a swim first. I feel stinky. I need to take a bath. Oh, he's like hairless. What the heck? You don't. It, there's no use. Oh, he's gonna one v one him. I don't think the predator is gonna laser him because then it's not as fun. He's gonna one v one him. Claw versus knife. Oh my, why? That's not even, he was the most defenseless one. Predator, either Predator can't aim or he really just wanted to take out the most defenseless one. That was really sad. Oh my gosh. No way they're gonna kill Arnold. Get to the chopper! Get to the chopper! He just said it, classic! Get to the chopper! I didn't know that was from this movie. Get to the chopper! <laughs> so why was the Predator just taking out the camp? I guess it wouldn't be as fun, you know, individually. <gasps> He's so dead. We love Arnold. He's a great guy, great actor. Genuinely amazing human beings. You guys should see some of the interviews with him. He's a really inspiring individual and so kind-hearted. I mean, he's made his fair share of mistakes. Everyone has, but, you know, he really tries to be a good person. Did he just jump in after him? Oh, you're done. Arnold, I'm sorry to say, but you are done. He can't see him because of the clay. The clay will really remove your heat signature. I don't think it works like that. He couldn't see me. Oh my gosh, Arnold, you need more clay. It's not gonna work if you don't have more clay. <sighs> That's his spine. He just took out his spine. Very nice. There's no way it's gonna be a full moon like three nights in a row. He also hasn't eaten anything or drank water that we've seen. He must be dying. <laughs> this would be Predator's biggest prize yet. One that fights back. Awesome. Maybe put the torch down, lure him. But he doesn't know that it's because of heat. Never mind, I guess he does. I would pee my pants on the spot. fireworks what the heck can't camouflage now can ya Arnold's gotcha put the little plant What 
a jump. What? That's his real vision? He is so much scarier. One ugly motherfucker. <laughs> he didn't like that. He is so much scarier without his mask. And he really didn't like being dissed on. Oh my gosh, the design is so unique. He knows he can't take him, he's way too strong. He's so scary. How do they make it look so realistic? How are they getting the muscles to move and stuff? He's just slapping him now. He's just, he really is just having fun with him. He figured out the trap. He's not stupid. Oh! I feel so tense right now. He's definitely not dead. Definitely not dead. That would be way too easy. Definitely not dead. Arnold. I'm begging you to turn around right now. <sighs> Arnold's done. Oh, he feels sorry for him. What the hell are you? He can mimic voices. That's a bomb. That's a bomb. Get out. Get out. Get. Get out. Oh, they can laugh too? There's no way he, he's survived that. My God. I think he should retire. I think he's proven himself. But now the question asks, how many others are there? Why do they come during the heat? Why Earth? What is the purpose? So I just finished watching Predator for the first time and I have to say I was surprised. Honestly, it is a classic and it is so actiony. I thought that there would be like, I'm so used to films that are essentially just about plot, about backstory, about character, character growth, but this is just boom, boom, boom action. This monster is scary. We don't know what it is. Why are we being hunted? We're being hunted. And you have a whole team of people that have already been through so much shit and you can tell they have been through so much but they come together and they try their hardest to defeat this. The action was really good. It was peak action. I can't even imagine to know how much money went into the explosives. But another thing that I really, really liked was Predator's um, design. Predator genuinely looked like an alien. Visually, Predator was so scary. I felt obviously like the camouflage was a little bit goofy because you know, it's the 80s, but it was impressive. It was super imp impressive for the era that it was in. Um, another thing is, I just felt like it was a lot of fun to watch. Like it was just a lot of action. It was just man versus like, pr 
predator and you didn't know who was gonna win because the predator had this upper hand you didn't know what you were fighting and it was so scary and the fact that you saw predator so late into the film made you so much more afraid of it you know you're introduced to it only by the fact that you find out that it skinned people and then eventually you realize that those were its trophies it, it killed people and stole its skin or like skull and spine and used it as trophies it's a hunter and it just had a primal instinct to hunt but other than that i thought it was a really fun action film i think it was perfect for its era i didn't grow up with it you know i'm really spoiled with today's movies um but for the era i think it's magnificent i think it was ahead of its time um and it was cheesy it had the cheesy one-liners there's a lot of moments that you can recreate you can laugh at you could be like oh my god that was amazing oh my gosh that was scary and i really really respect how much effort time and effort went into creating this monster so thank you guys so much for watching i hope you guys enjoyed i'm sorry if i didn't talk nearly as much i was really just in it um and just seeing where it was gonna go so thank you guys again and i will see you guys in the next video bye everyone bye.